Play horseshoes, a fun English phrase explained. Hello, everyone, welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore the interesting phrase, play horseshoes. This phrase is not just about a game, but it's also a part of everyday English language. So, let's dive in and learn more about it. The phrase, play horseshoes, literally refers to a lawn game. In this game, players take turns throwing horseshoes at stakes in the ground, aiming to get them as close as possible to the stake or even encircle it. However, the phrase can also be used metaphorically in everyday conversation. It signifies attempting something that requires precision and skill, often with an element of luck involved. Horseshoes as a game has a rich history. It dates back to the Roman Empire and has evolved over centuries. The phrase carries with it this historical significance, making it an interesting topic in both language and culture discussions. Understanding the history of the game can give you a deeper appreciation of the phrase and its usage. When you hear someone say they're going to play horseshoes, they might be referring to the actual game. But often, it's used to describe an activity that involves skill and a bit of luck. For example, I'm going to play horseshoes with my job applications, means the person is trying their luck and skill in applying for jobs, hoping to land the right one. There are variations and related phrases that you might come across. For instance, close only counts in horseshoes is a common saying. This means that being close to a goal or answer counts in horseshoes but not always in other situations. It's a humorous way to acknowledge a near success or a good attempt. We hope you enjoyed learning about the phrase, play horseshoes, and its place in the English language. It's not just a phrase, it's a piece of culture and history. Remember, learning English is not just about words and grammar, but also about understanding the culture and stories behind the phrases. See you in our next video.